Good morning, everyone. Fife Farley here. It is May 29th. It is Tuesday. We got a big slate of baseball games, uh, one of which I'm going to cap for you. Um, had a fantastic streak. I apologize for that video. Um, had a great weekend with my family out camping, and uh, you can tell I'm paying the price for it with my voice today. Um, and wasn't able to get that Blue Jays pick uploaded in time. It was a 48-second video. It took over two hours. Uh, I, I set my phone down and it was about the last I looked at it and let it just upload, and um, yeah, two hours later, it didn't make it in time. So, uh, just sorry about that. But uh, meanwhile, it's been seven of the last eight uh, picks have been on the right side, so let's continue that going today. And also, of course, I want to say thank you to subscribers and welcome to all the new subscribers. I hope you get some value out of these videos and out, out of these picks. I always encourage to... Uh, um, to listen to the why of every pick and not just the what of every pick. So uh, don't follow blindly. Uh, if you agree with why I'm taking the side, then uh, feel free to put your hard-earned money on that side. But that's up to you. All right, so today I'm looking at the Cincinnati Reds traveling to the just ice-cold bats of the Arizona Diamondbacks. Uh, we have Luis Castillo on the mound um, going to Arizona, going against Zach Godley. Real quick, Luis Castillo going against Arizona. Uh, the last three seasons, which he's pitched two seasons, two starts. He's gone 12 and two-thirds innings, only seven hits given up, four earned runs for a 2.84 ERA. He's one and one in those starts. The Arizona Diamondbacks are hitting 156 against him, just 156. He has pitched in Chase Field, of which he went six and two-thirds, gave up only three hits for a shutout, got the win in that game. The Arizona Diamondbacks roster as it is right now, not a lot of at-bats, only 26 total at-bats, only four hits though for a 154 batting average. Now let's jump over to Zach Godley of the Arizona, of, uh, Arizona Diamondbacks real quick against Cincinnati. Last three seasons, he's had two starts, three games played. He is 2-1. and one. He got a decision every one of those with an 11-9-1 ERA, 11 and a third innings. He had 20 hits given up and 15 runs given up. That's amazing. Um, the Reds hitting 377 against him. All right, now going with this roster right now, uh, they're, they're hitting 464 against Zach Godley. Now, again, it's not a ton of data. We only have 28 at-bats. He's only gone 11 and a third innings against him. But in, a, in 28 at-bats, there's 13 hits. Uh, given up uh, by Godley to the Cincinnati Reds. Joey Votto is 4 of 6. Uh, Shubler's 2 of 2. Uh, Billy Hamilton's 3 of 6. Um, just on down the lineup, I mean, almost everyone has gotten a hit uh, off of Godley that's in the uh, um, Reds lineup here. Uh, real quick, also want to jump back over to this season. Castillo in his last five starts. Check it out. Two earned runs, two earned runs, two earned runs, one earned run, two earned runs. He's been fantastic. Um, meanwhile, Godley here, the last few starts, six earned runs, one, four, four, one, four. His ERA has been jumping up. Meanwhile, Castillo's has been dropping down. Castillo's been doing fantastic. In the month of May, Arizona Diamondbacks are 30th in baseball in batting average by a long shot, hitting 188. If you're backing Arizona, uh, you must have a lot of confidence in a 188 batting average. Only 68 runs this entire month. It's the 29th of the month. They only have 68 runs scored. That is 15 less than the lowest other run total in Major League Baseball. They are 35 points less on their batting average than all the other teams in baseball. Meanwhile, Cincinnati Reds right in the middle of the pack, 14th in baseball with a 247 uh, batting average, 107 runs scored. So I am going to back the Cincinnati Reds. Let me get to one last thing. I always like to point out the betting percentages as they fall right now, knowing that we're going to have some movement before the game starts. So I have them at a plus 110 is what my book has. Um, you can check yours. Opened up at a minus 140 has moved down to minus 120 with the, with some sharp action coming in over on the Cincinnati side. Hold on, I'm uploading my latest numbers. 78% um, of the tickets on Arizona, 71% of the money on Arizona. So we got about a 7% difference of sharper money coming in on the Cincinnati red side. It's not overwhelming, but it is a good amount. Not to mention I like the capping side of it. Um, Cincinnati Reds won four of the last 10. Meanwhile, Diamondbacks 
only two of the last ten. Uh, they are on their way down. They're having a terrible time trying to hit the ball. So I'm going to back Castillo, has, uh, who has traditionally done well against uh, Godley, who has not done well against the Reds. All right, good luck, everyone. Check out my other picks down in the comments. I'll see you again soon.